Yo, what is up guys? Tack coming at you with another video. This is going to be how to win more games as jungle. So the way you wanna win more games as jungle is to just simply gank more. Yeah. Um, especially when you're playing ganking like junglers like Poppy, Vi, Lee Sen, Kha'Zix, you just wanna gank at every opportunity that you can, meaning that you essentially wanna be willing to drop camps to gank unsuccessful opportunities to gank so like if i see the middle and then there's 200 hp and i'm in the middle of doing raptors i will drop raptors and immediately go mid lane um and just try to execute a gank instead of me trying to finish my camp and then go and by that time it might be already too late really go for a nap <clears throat> all right so Assessing, assessing the matchups we have versing Talon, um, the lanes that are very good for us to gank are lanes like All right. top lane and jungle. Yep. Uh, well, top lane and jungle to invade because he's flashless and Talon relies on his jumps to get away, but then I have my W, so if I could get an invade going with like Yone, LeBlanc, you should be easy pickings. Essentially, you want to counter gank where he's at as well. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Jace versus Ken in top, I do believe Jace wins this matchup just because he has the time jumping onto him. And, uh, yeah. But essentially, I just like to full clear and gank at any given opportunity that I can. As Talon started top side. As indicated. But yeah, even at level two, like if I see any man is like hyper trading, level two, level one, like you know they burn the summoner to get all in or whatever, then I'll just go immediately there, waste no time. Me, the hero? Nah, that's ridiculous. Hmm. So no gank, lanes are gankable, bot lane is crashing, right, and I'm pathing towards top side. so the only lane that I'm looking at right now is top lane, and that lane is looking pretty gankable, um, as it stands right now, like I could have went up there right now, immediately, I don't know if it had, it would have been good, so now he's gonna get a ward down, it's just a matter of watching where he wards. Right, and then we'll just pad around it entirely, or we will. Uh, I'm gonna ping my volume off here because you know Talon path butt side. Right. So see, he's really low here. I'm just gonna go straight top. Swoops preemptively. Well, it looks like it's a solo bolo. Yeah. All right. Well, it is what it is. <clears throat> which is great for Grumpulus. Ping this off. We know Talon is bot side. We don't see mid as well. This is like really bad if my bot lane dies here. For no reason. All you could do is ping. If they choose to die, then it's like not really much else. So there. But we know top is flashless as well. I thought that would have given me level 4. For whatever reason. You see, this Jace is very not playing mindful of jungler. So you punish. You should know I'm top side. I haven't shown yet, and it's full clear timer window. All right, so now he's tilted. That's also something you can abuse in your game, because this is what a master tier game. Right on average, and they still don't respect enemy jungler. I'm gonna walk down here, but I don't think I could do much. Uh, An enemy has been slain. Like, he's gonna crash this wave. I'm gonna go. It's a good thing I didn't back so I could recall and catch it actually. Or just walk down and catch it. Which is a lot of XP for us, a lot of money. I don't know, I'd be taking my camp here. But there he is, yeah. <laughs> just fine. 
Well, it's either we kill Talon or Zoe. Sure. It's really good. Sometimes opportunities just arise like that out of nowhere, and you gotta be ready to capitalize. For sure. We could relook top here. I don't know Prioritize is getting my, my level 5 before going top lane, just because it makes my gank so much stronger with the extra point in Q. Or extra damage. Sitting on a lot of money, but like just for tempo standpoint. I just never got the chance. So here I'm gonna path towards my mid, he's okay. Again, okay, I'm gonna go straight top. Should be dead. Give the double cannon. Boom. <clears throat> and I still haven't recalled yet, right? I'm sitting on 40 CS, 2k gold. This is insane. Right, but sometimes opportunities arise because people are not mindful. They're like, okay, well, Jim, they're surely back now. No, that's not true. Nothing is universally true in this world, right? People say women are gold diggers. People say men are trash. Nothing is universally true. And I will say the same for the jungler and enemy jungler. But, you know, there will be signs and little things that may indicate that some things are true. And those are the things that you should play off of. <clears throat> so I'm gonna ping my money. I'm gonna ping red and then maybe look bottom. Bot lane is looking pretty safe. Look how they're playing, right? Like they're playing right in front of the turret right here. Start building towards my divine, get my boots, cause movement speed is really good stat for jungle and coffee in general. Uh, so there's Talon. Um, I didn't use his key. He might be dead here, especially if Talon has a knife. It's a shutdown to Talon, unfortunate. He's sitting on a lot of wards. Um, never got the word down, which is unfortunate, but, uh, I don't think he needed to ult for the Jace kill. Like, if he had ulti there, he could have maybe even 2v1. So, it's like, mismanagement of cooldowns. Here, Balin is looking pretty weak. Twitch is just out of stealth. Nice one ult here. I got it. What? I don't got it. Oh, well, two for one. Not bad. And we got a plate too. I walk over any words. I believe so. The hammer does most of the work. I just All right, it's fine. Just continue farming. It would be a good dragon angle if my bowling didn't die. But I don't have smite. It's definitely solo bow, but without smite, I don't have anything to secure it. And you, you know, I could just run into Talon for no reason. Alright, we could continue playing for topside. Uh, Kennen is a good person to get fed, especially versus, like, also another thing you could do as jungle is assess win conditions, right? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm down to fight here. It's a really good fight. Focus is all over the place, but we went out. Twitch got my shutdown though, which is really bad, and I don't know where Talon went. Uh, Twitch flashed onto me. I don't think he had vision of me, because this was red warded, so I could have kept running, and I should have been fine, actually. I guess that's a misplay by me. But we still came out ahead, because we're getting played to bottom, as well as Talon was forced to probably recall off that, where he's continuing to do his camps. And we got, uh, like I said, we got played to bottom. So... One in the end there. I'm just gonna walk top here. Mean, this is warded, but it's he's so far up that it doesn't even matter. He's gonna be dead there. So here we have an opportunity to take Harold. He's really good. Yeah, enemy mid laner, we're getting plates here. We turned it around. Good stuff. Oh, 
There's some unfortunate Same. deaths happening here. I think we kill this guy. Most likely not. We don't have enough resources. Yeah, to kill him. But I did get a DH stack. Unfortunately, because of all the stuff all happening. Oh, he leveled up. Seriously? I might be able to just walk up and kill him. I have no mana. Boom. Sucks. <clears throat> yeah. He leveled up at like the last second too. Or like in the middle of that. Rather. Happens, happens. We make mistakes. He tunneled. But like, yeah. If I had like just had mana to cast any one of my abilities, it would have been a done deal. Unfortunate. My fault. My fault. But yeah, I am trying to be an objective base player based on the lead I'm getting, but you're just like, like I said, there's opportunities being made on the map, so it makes things a bit harder. Yeah, I'm just gonna do my Raptors here though. I just feel like I could do worse much at this angle. I don't think Twitch would be able to show like that, yeah. You did get the speed boost from the shrine. Sure, if this is like the first dragon, so it dies pretty fast. Like, look at look at the damage it's taking, right? So it's an easy take. And you did see Talon go towards Drift Hero. Um, I don't should be on this. And my mid laner should have been like willing to check it. You got the shield from Eclipse, which is really unfortunate. Uh, we secured it. Alright, an interesting gameplay. So there's a minute left on this timer for Herald. I can't block that. I do want to use it before it times out. Alright, we got a Herald off, no one for one. <clears throat> I had to focus on getting the Herald off there because I wouldn't have really gotten another chance to use it. Like, I could have recalled. And my Yone was getting chased by the Zoe. And I was also in Zoe like kill range off the bubble, so I just had a manner of playing it safe. Like I just wanted to try to get my Herald off, because it's like if I didn't get it off there, I might have not ever have gotten it off. I'm gonna ping this. My LeBlanc should be okay to face to check Talon. And not die. Okay, Talon is not doing my camps. That's all that matters. I really wanna reset here. Because we're sitting on so much money, we just got Herald and whatnot. But look at this. What do you know? Or what do you know? JC is overextended again. I think he's playing a little bit more mindful of me. I'm gonna deny this off the of, uh, Talon as well. Looks like Zoe has to bring up. Really big. Uh, Rishes Dark Comp, they're triple AD, so it's very straightforward with Ninja Tabbies. Dead Man plus Divine plus Dark Harvest is a really good combination on Poppy, so we're just gonna bring it back. Ready, like, so fed and strong. Right, these turrets are just 1 HP, so normally my camps are up. I really want to do my camps, but they're looking like they're putting themselves in fight range. We did just see Talon here for a brief moment, so if you look at the ping and for a map, there he is. And yeah, we might be able to get something here. Looking at Lulu for sure. <laughs> that was kind of disrespectful of me, but like she had no other choice. Like, so just let her walk into you versus you. Okay, I admit, I'm off. Playing like that, and then we go path towards top lane. Here, yeah, just very free. The map is so open; it's hard for this Jace to play. Oh, 
Why are you pressing the magic button? Just ensure our cannon doesn't die, even though we'd want to, him to get the kills. But you see, as you can tell, we're sitting on the most KP as jungle, which is pretty normal. It's either support or like jungle has the most KP. Uh, yeah, we're almost dead man. Oh, let's see if we could save the blink. No, we couldn't. Let's see if Yoni could do something here. No, we can't. Alright, let's go back and do our camps. Now we're just having a bit too much fun. <clears throat> Alright, well I think they've given up. So yeah, that was pretty much how to win more games. Uh, jungle, they should be FFing or maybe they're waiting. I don't know. We have Dragon in 40 seconds. Checking the Dragon timer. So we have enough time to do our top side reset and go Drag. So might be enough for Deadman's plate as well. Yeah, it looks like I'll get just about enough gold for my Deadman's as well, which is really big. We have the Kennen Flash Ulti available for this fight as well. Um, I'm going to have to wait a little bit for my Deadman's, but I'll still be able to make it in time just because Deadman's is that extra movement speed boost. Position yourself at the end of the fountain to cover up distance, as much distance. Get our Deadman's. Two, man's, two items spike before 17 minutes. And we have the dragon spawning. Should be a free take. My raptors are gone. That means Talon with a bit of thieving, but it's okay because we're about to thieve his LP. We should back out here. It's the only play. This is the only opportunity the team gets to make. Enemy team makes to get a play to like. Get some kills and whatnot. And my bottom is not really being respectful or mindful of it. Do your sweeps to make sure they can't see us. We found Twitch. Oh, it looks like Lulu's giving up because she didn't alter. There's J Splash. A lot of damage. At this point, the game is pretty much over, but, you know, it can always be thrown, so we'll just continue doing our camps. Just try to save, uh, get you here. I'm good. Alright. Now I've eaten however many seconds. Maybe loop around. I don't think it's happening. Have LeBlanc support. So there you go, there's LeBlanc support. Things. Support things. At this point, the game is pretty much over, so we're just gonna focus on trying to end it as fast as possible. The enemy team seems to have given up. Talon bought an elixir, I think. Oh no, Lulu Alton MK. Okay. Alright, uh. But yeah, that was how to win more games of jungle. As like I said, I just gank as much as I can. Um, this is no work, especially if you're in the lower world. Your because there's so much more opportunity in the Lulu's. Like, look. Walk around, touch my buttons and shit. One thing that you guys cannot do as players, you know? Jerry's having a bit of fun. Your team has destroyed an 
think I'm gonna have to reset one more time before we end this game though, unfortunately. I should have probably muted chat for the thing. Oh, there we go. Seems like they're letting us end though. Yeah, that was how to win more games with jungle. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, I hope you learned a thing. Thanks for watching. Bye.